Hi again everyone, here we are. Another little test today. A few different hot chilli sauces. So we shall see how we go on. I'll work my way up, I think. <laughs> uh, the first one is... Nando's sweet chili jam packed with tangy tomatoes and peri peri and African bird's eye chili warm and sweet with a tingle of heat used within three weeks once opened right so Teaspoon. Now you can see the chili jam, it looks very much just like ketchup. That is actually nice. It's got a beautiful smooth flavour. A lovely sweet taste of tomato. And that lovely chilli heat. Brilliant. Pound. And this is from B&M's. So there you go. And now we have a Tesco sweet chilli and garlic sauce. Again this comes in at a pound and the ingredients are glucose syrup, sugar, water, spirit vinegar, garlic puree, modified mace starch, salt, dried garlic, bird's eye chillies, red pepper, chilli flakes, suitable for vegans. So we'll give it a go. And it's uh, three stars for hot. We'll try if I can get into it, huh? <laughs> It's a lot runnier is this one. Oops. And that's the what it looks like. So this is sweet chili and garlic. Back in the mess. Right, that's a very, very sweet sauce. As for it being three chilies hot, my mouth's on fire at the moment, but it's uh, it's sweet. Sweet and sour really, certainly got a vinegary aftertaste, but I'm saying that, 
overall it's nice right the next one we will try is another one from Nando's peri peri sauce she says it's hot Water, distilled vinegar, lemon puree, onion puree, salt, African bird's eye chillies, paprika, green chilli, garlic puree, stabilizers, etc. And this is hot. Once opened, refrigerate and use within three months. This also came in at a pound from B and M's again. Yeah, B and M's. Right. That's the Nando's Piri Piri. Unfortunately, it's not for me personally, and it's that lemon. It has an overpowering lemon zested taste, and it's quite unpleasant on the palate. As for the heat, well, there's no denying it, it is hot, but no, not for me. So far the best one is definitely without doubt Nando's Sweet Chilli Jam. Right, what have we got here? Original Srinacha. Hot chilli sauce. Um, £1.29 from B&M's. Another one to fight to get into. Let's have a look. Get the knife. So, that's the Sriracha. Which is water, red chilli, sugar, garlic, salt, stabiliser, thickener, acidity regulator. Store in a cool dry place once open, store in the fridge and use within 30 days. And this is an authentic product of Thailand. That's very hot. It's very sweet. That ain't bad at all. Not bad at all. So far, what would I give? 10 out of 10. Every time. 7 out of 10. 1 out of 10. 
And if you like the sweetness and the heat, 10 out of 10 for this one too, the Sriracha. Right. And the next one we're moving on to Grace. Scotch Bonnet, all the way from Jamaica. Ingredients, water, scotch bonnet mash, chilli salt, sugar, spirit vinegar, scallion mash, black pepper, garlic, thyme, pimento powder, onion powder, chimichurri seasoning, ground spice, a smoked paprika, Grace, Scotch Bonnet Grilling Sauce. Use the exotic flavour of Scotch Bonnets to add to Caribbean flair to every meal. So, it looks a very thin sauce. And there it is, that's the old Scotch Bonnet. You can really smell the chilli in here. Again, that's hot. Smoky. And if you like smoky things on like barbecue, this would be a brilliant sauce. But it is also very hot. And now here is the piece de resistance. McElhenney Company of Avery Island, Tabasco. Habanero sauce. Ingredients are distilled vinegar, habanero pepper, cane sugar, Tabasco. Brand pepper sauce, red pepper, salt, mango puree, onion, banana, tamarind, papaya, spices and garlic. And a pepper mash. This is for the adventurous. It's a brand of habanero sauce, a Jamaican style hot sauce from the McElhenney Company. This legendary pepper can bring tears to the eye. And it has a Scoville rating of 200,000 plus. Shake well, it says. So wish me well with this one, guys and girls. My goodness me. I think I'll leave it at that for now, just in case. <laughs> there it is. 200,000 Scoville's worth of Tabasco. It does smell very Caribbean. A lot of the Caribbean sauces have that a distinct, distinct taste. Right guys, here we go. That's really nice. It reminds me of the uh, South Winds and then corner sauces, Jamaican hot sauces. As I'm talking to you, the heat's building in my mouth. That's, uh, that's an amazing sauce.
It's sweet, it's sour, and it is definitely very, very Caribbean. Ten out of ten. Excellent. Absolutely excellent. So, overall, let's work it out. Ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. Seven out of ten. And one. And each one of them are lovely in their own right. With the exception of the Nando's hot sauce. But again, as I say, it's because I don't like lemon. Well, I do, but not in. <coughs> not in the sauces. <coughs> The Tabasco sauce is really going to work on me now. My lips are numb. My tongue's on fire. My throat's on fire. I'm sweating. Nose is running. But it's brilliant. Absolutely superb. I'd recommend that to anyone. And that's £1.29 from Morrison's. Anyway. I hope you've enjoyed what you've seen, an old bald man suffering under the intense heat. Thank you all, each and every one of you. I hope you've enjoyed it, as I say. Click the like button if you have. Feel free to leave a comment in the box below. Hit the bell icon for any future uploads. And please feel free to subscribe. And to all of you who have subscribed already, Thank you so much. Namaste. Have a wonderful weekend.